Hey, I'm, I'm back, and I have a story that I just heard about that shows a little bit of how God works in our, in our lives. Even when we don't understand that things are, that he's working for our own good. But most of you know the Le Moines service camp. Well, the uh, camp manager during this time where one is locked in and, and no money is really coming into to the camp at the moment, he was looking at his bills and got surprised when he opened up uh, a bill that was over $8,000. And he simply uh, asked the Lord, directly asked the Lord, how are you going to pay this? And in the very next instant after, after he said this, he gets a text message from one of his uh, pastor friends who simply said, we are, my congregation took a collection. And so we just wanted to send this to you uh, and hope, hope it helps. What I, what I want to make sure that you understand is we have a need and the camp manager didn't know he had this need. But in the background, God is working. He's working the hearts of his people. And I don't know how many people gave to this offering, this love offering. But when he was told the amount, it was $9,000, a little more than what, what they actually needed to pay this debt. But yet, he didn't know he needed it. And he got answer immediately to, to it. A prayer. We never know how God is going to answer our prayers. It might be you coming up and and talking with somebody. It might be you you praying with someone. But God answers prayer, and He answers prayer all the time. Again, let's close with a word of prayer and. Uh, will be deployed. Heavenly Father, again, we just want to raise, raise your name and thank you for uh, sending Jesus into our lives. Help us to uh, continually pray, to ask, uh, even for the little things, things that most people wouldn't give a, the time of day to. But help us to, uh, to pray, because you will answer. And you will answer in a, in a mighty way, in one that just doesn't seem to make any sense. So we thank you, Lord. We thank you for sending uh, Jesus into our lives. And we pray in his name. Amen.